Hello YouTubers, um, so this is my first video review <coughs> on um, engine remap. So I've been looking into getting this done for quite a bit. My car, I drive an Audi A5, um, 2 liters diesel and with 163 brake horsepower. Um, so the reason why I wanted to get it done is because I live in a hilly city and at times whenever you're going uphill you can feel like the car is asking for more gas and the reason be obviously the Audi A5 it's a hatchback by the way five doors it's a heavy car and um, so therefore you need to have a, a substantial power in the car to, in order to go uphill so I, I didn't think it was right. I felt like obviously the S line, uh, mine is not the S line, it's the um, Technique version. Uh, so, sorry, just got a nice car driving past. So, really, I had I felt like I needed more power. So, I, I researched about uh, the best companies around where I live, where I could go and get it done. So, I visited this place, uh, SLT, this is their business car and um, the diagnostic and remap etc so I went I spoke to the, the guys at the garage they said yeah it can take up to two hours the price was good as well so I did spend a few hours yesterday um, to find out the pros and cons and it, I would say 80 sorry 95 percent of the comments I read was all good People were happy, their car felt faster. But the best review I, I've seen was this guy who also with an Audi A5 who said, do not expect to drive an Audi A5 and then after the remap, you're gonna be driving a Ferrari engine. It's nothing like that, no. You will definitely feel a boost, but it's not like humongous. So anyway, Moving forward, so I went in today, took my car in the morning around 10 o'clock. It took roughly two hours. And uh, like I said earlier, I've got uh, the original brake horse power was 163. And now I'm with 210, which is amazing. And um, so the guy at the garage said, okay, take it for a test drive. Obviously, being close 12 o'clock was rush hour. Not rush hour, but it was quite busy. A lot of people out having lunch. My, so I test drove it and you could definitely feel the kick whenever you press the gas so I was quite happy um, but I think I still need more time to actually realize obviously I've been driving this car for a year so I know where it struggles and where it doesn't and so it, the guy even at the garage said okay leave it for at least a day keep driving it I think after 24 hours driving the car you, the, the the new horse brake horsepower will definitely settle in and you definitely notice the difference constantly uh, so this is my first review just to say that I went in uh, did the the remapping and um, now I got 210 uh, when I used to have 163 so uh, I'll do another video next week to let you guys know how everything's going peace thank you